preparing for a weekend road trip or a far off exotic adventure, today's Talk Takeaway guest is here with all the tips you need to make packing for your summer vacation easy and stress free. Please welcome the author of Organize and Create Discipline, an A to Z guide to an organized existence, our good friend Justin Klosky. Hey, Justin, welcome back to the show. Everyone loves vacation, nobody likes packing. Before we put one thing in the suitcase, Explain your overall strategy to packing. So the, the simplest way to do it is to plan ahead. How many people in here are day of packers? Yeah. Stop the madness, okay? That, yes, right? No more day of packing, Sharon, or anyone else in here. If you plan and think about where you're going and what you're doing, you're already ahead of the game. And then you could start figuring out, okay, what do I want to bring, okay? From there, it's then very important to start assessing your trip and picking out outfits, okay? So, we're gonna go to not overpacking, okay? Everyone in here is guilty of that? Yes, yes. Go on. Okay. But yeah. once you've picked out all the items, right? right? Yes. That's the problem. How do we get them in the case? Okay, so there, there's a difference between picking out the items and yeah. really planning what items you need for specific occasions, okay? We need versatile items. We're going to be packing, let's say, for a two-week trip. So you're not going to have the room for 15 pairs of shoes. You're going to have to have maybe two or three <laughs> pairs of shoes. Sorry. I love you. I understand. Right? So versatile <laughs> items. For every three shirts, have a pair of pants or shorts. Shoes, you need two pairs of shoes that are versatile in color. And then, of course, you're going to want to make sure you have room for it. So while you're packing, we're going to move over to here. Okay. While you're packing, we're going to change the strategy of how we do these things, okay? So roll, okay? No more folding. Rolling. Rolling. Okay. Rolling. Why, why oh, rolling? Because it will save space and it will also prevent wrinkles. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna put Yeah, we got some applause. So roll. Okay. Also, <clears throat> use the dead space. I know we've talked about this on the wall, but use the dead space inside of the shoes for maybe belts, socks, because oh. we're not using these things as it is. How do you feel about that? I see your eyes are like, there we go. We're gonna put. Well, I wouldn't put my knickers in there. Okay. <laughs> okay, but if you are putting your knickers in there, you yes. can put them in a plastic bag. Oh. In yes, that's okay. good. Okay, fair. Okay. A dryer sheet inside the suitcase, as well as a garbage bag. The reason why, when you're traveling, especially with a carry-on, you're gonna have dirty laundry. Where's it gonna go? Right. Yeah. Put the dirty laundry in the garbage bag. Add the fabric softener. You're good. Bulky items, right? The bulky items, like the mm -hmm. coats, you're not going to want to put in your carry-on, so wear the coat on the airplane. It'll keep you warm in a cool plane. And then, of course, hats. We're not going to want to stuff the hat in, so, you know, wear the hat on the trip and start the vacation. <laughs> 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 all, right. all right. All right. Talk to us about... Correct me if I'm wrong, Sharon. Go on. A woman's heaviest bag is the toiletry bag. Always. Okay. Always. Help us out, Justin. And it's just in case. I need to take it just in case. So very, very simple, right? If you're like me, you're going to want to have the same brands that you're using on an everyday basis. Mm -hmm. Have a toiletry kit already packed and ready to go in your carry-on. So when you're going to be traveling, you pull down the suitcase, the, the toiletry kit's already in there. The only thing you're going to have to remember to do is refill the things in the toiletry kit. Makeup is different for you ladies, okay? You're going to have to probably have a separate makeup kit, which is totally fine. You'll bring that the day of. It won't be sitting in the bag. Right. Pare down the big shampoos and conditioners into these little three-ounce bottles, which we all know are TSA-friendly. Then you also have contact lens cases or small plastic containers for your moisturizers, the good creams that you want to use. If you wear glasses, these are obviously all around your house. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> and then... If you are bringing something that you're scared is a leak in your suitcase, just take a piece of plastic wrap, put it against the mouth, turn. So simple! <laughs> Why did I think that? No, but it's explosion when you unpack. That's so Heavens. smart. All right. Jewelry? You right? gotta help out Sharon here. Uh, Sharon, <laughs> the jewelry. <laughs> how, okay, how, okay. How to pack jewelry. How to pack jewelry. Now, this is fun, okay? Necklaces, okay? All you ladies always throw your necklaces into a, a jewelry, you know, like, pouch. And they're all... Tangled up, and you're spending 15, 20 yes. minutes, right? So a straw, I know this sounds so silly, but, you know, the straw will help contain the jewelry, and it won't get tangled up. Buttons. I know. Right? Buttons for earrings. Look at how simple this is. Put the earrings through. Everyone's got buttons around there. 
And if you want to take it a step further, a pill box. If you're picking out jewelry for spe specific days of the week, you already have it ready to go, Sunday through Saturday. There you go. I love it. When we come right back, Justin shows us the easiest way to travel with a bottle of wine. Don't go away. We are back with organization expert Justin Klosky, who's teaching us the best ways to pack for summer travel. Your final tip is how to pack a bottle of wine. Yes. We got some people who like the wine out there. So obviously, this can't go in a carry-on because we know it's too big. But when you're checking your, your luggage and you want to travel with wine, get a pool floaty, you know, the ones that would save your kids. Blow it up, stick it in the bag. You're not going to worry about spilled or broken bottles. <laughs> so smart. Justin Klosky, thank you so much, Justin. Now, because we want to make sure everyone's summer travel is just a little bit easier, Everyone in our studio audience is going home with an ECBC Premium Travel Bag. ECBC Premium Travel Bags feature the one-of-a-kind TSA-friendly Fast Pass system and offers sophisticated style, organization, protection, and reliability. For your chance to win one at home, go to thetalk.com.